In this video, I'm going to show you how easy it is to add a Facebook conversion pixel to your WordPress site. So stay tuned. Okay, welcome back. This is Karen from In Online Solution, and what you're looking at is our landing page for our website planning guide and website planning checklist. And since I am running ad to drop traffic to this landing page, I thought why not teach people how to add a conversion pixel on their WordPress site. So if you're running a Facebook ad, you would want to be able to track how many people signed up because they clicked on that specific ad. Now what you will need to do is go to Facebook and type facebook.com slash ads slash manage and on the left hand side you will see conversion tracking. So this is the very first step you need to create um, your tracking pixel before you, you create your ad. So these are some of these are two of our current uh, pixels and then on the uh, top right you will see a green button for uh, creating a pixel so click on that now you will need to choose uh, what type of action that you want to measure so you can select from the drop down menu there's for checkouts registrations leads key page views ads to cart and other website conversions so in this case since we are promoting um, a sign up sign up page or a landing page for a free ebook we will select registrations now for the pixel name you can just give this um, any name so for for me this will be let me see free ebook sorry free ebook downloads okay and then create pixel so now what happens is Facebook gives you a pixel code that you need to copy and paste on your website go to your WordPress site and then Go to plugins and then click on add new and what we're going to do is we will search for um, a plugin so type Facebook conversion pixel. Okay so I already have this installed on our site so this is the one that you want to um, install with this um, picture right here. Um, it's called Facebook conversion pixel so click on that. And then once that is installed, um, you will see that on the left hand side under uh, settings and then click on Facebook conversion pixel. Okay, now you will need to enable Facebook conversion pixel on um, these uh, post types. So I have just, this is um, automatically checked, so I would just um, leave it as it is. Now what we're going to do is we will go to um, pages and then I have created a test page in here so we will edit this. So let's say this is the download page and this is where we will need to add the conversion um, pixel because Facebook will be able to track how many people have signed up or registered because they saw the ad. Now at the bottom, you will not put it in here, but at the bottom you will see that there's um, the Facebook conversion pixel. So check the box that says where it says insert Facebook conversion pixel code on this page. And then on this box right here, this is where you will add or paste your Facebook conversion pixel code from Facebook. So go back to Facebook and then copy that and then paste that there. And then once you're done, okay, let's just um, publish this one. Okay, once you're done, um, what I normally do is I just um, go to that page and then um, refresh that page. Okay, then now we will go to Facebook and then close this and then, then we will refresh the page. Okay, so now as you can see, um, we can see our pixel that we have just created for the free ebook downloads and now 
it's um, active. So it says we have received events from this pixel in the last week. So this was actually verified um, just a while ago. So now that your pixel code is active, you can start creating um, your ad. So you're all set. So I hope this has been helpful. If you have any questions, just feel free to tweet me at NLNS and I'll be happy to help you. So I'll see you on the next video.